Hiya there and welcome to uh, Trains, Planes and Automobiles. Right, today I will be talking about the 1910 USS Florida battleship. The USS Florida, leader of a class of two dreadnought battleships, constructed for the United States Navy and put into service in 1911. The two Floridas were essentially repeats of the Delaware class, the first effective American dreadnoughts, with only a very, mi very minor changes. Though they had marginally more powerful machinery to maintain the 21 knot speed, they were the earliest US battleships retained under the Washington Treaty of 1922 and underwent extensive rebuilds during the 1920s when they received much improved levels of protection and were converted to oil only firing with boilers taken from the cancelled 1916 program South Dakotas the USS Florida or also known as the BB-30 was constructed at the New York Navy Yard in Brooklyn she was laid down on the 9th of March 1909 she was launched on the 12th of May 1910 and entered service on the 15th of September 1911. She saw action in the war with Mexico in 1914 and later served with the Grand Fleet. Both she and her sister ship, the USS Utah, were surrendered under the 1930 London Naval Treaty. Florida was stricken and sold for scrap while Utah began the fleet anti-aircraft training ship. She was sunk at Pearl Harbor on the 7th of December 1941. The two Delawares had comparable machinery, but the turbine powered North Dakota proved more economical than her triple expansion engine sister ship. And the turbine machinery was specified for all American battleships from then on. The major differences between the Floridas and the Delawares concern the positioning of their masts and their funnels. The later ships had their funnels close set together between the two lattice masts. They had thicker armoured decks too, which accounted for the extra 1,500 tonnes of displacement weight. The USS Florida, she was a battleship. She had a four shaft Parson geared turbines producing a 28,000 SHP. She had a length of 159 meters or 521.7 feet. She had a width of 26.9 meters or 88.25 feet. She had a weight of 21,825 tons or 23,033 tons fully loaded. She had 1,000 on one staff or crew and she had a speed of 20.5 knots. She had a range of 6,700 miles or 12,400 kilometers at a speed of 10 knots. The principal armament of the USS Florida consisted of 10 12-inch 305mm guns mounted in pairs in turrets, two forwards super-firing, two aft back-to-back -back at main deck level and one super-firing ahead of them in Q position, abaft the main mast. She could therefore deploy all 10 guns on either beam. In addition, she carried 16 5 inch 127 mm guns in single sponsons at main deck. These were pretty useless as they regularly flooded when the ship was at full speed. She had two 21 inch 533 mm torpedo tubes also. So, this was some facts about the World War I USS Florida. Thanks for listening and watching and I hope you enjoyed the pictures. Please like, comment, subscribe. Thanks very much. Bye bye.